going on, you guys? It's your boy Avriel, our 32 here, and welcome to the top 16 Sprite Runic deck profile from YCS Niagara. So make sure you smash the living crap out of that subscribe button and the like button so that we can get to our goal of 1,000 subscribers. Ladies and gentlemen, I think that the Runic concept as a whole is very interesting. I have tried so hard to make this deck good, and I feel like this just solidifies the fact that the way that you play Runic is with a Sprite Engine. So let's just go ahead and dive on into it. He's playing 14 Hand Traps. So we're playing 3 Ash Blossom, 3 DD Crow, 2 Baylor, 3 Nibiru, along with 3 Infinite Impermanence. He said he only played 2 Baylor just because he wanted to make room in the deck because he said he was playing 42, so he just cut a Baylor. For the Sprite Engine, we're playing 3 copies of Blue, 3 Jet, 1 Carrot, 1 Pixie, 1 Red, with the 3 Swap Frog and the Rodent Toad. And I told you that Pixies was good. Pixies is freaking busted. For the spells, we're playing 2 copies of Destruction, 2 copies of Flashing Fire, only 1 of the Runic Field spell, the Runic Fountain. We're playing 3 copies of Freezing Curses, 3 Tip, because, I mean, it's a Rota. And then for the Sprite cards, we're playing 1 Smasher with the 3 Starter, and we already mentioned the Imperm. So, I did a couple test hands with this, and it seems deadly consistent. Like, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Well, of course, I say that, and then we open up, like, just a brick and a half. So, you set the Imperm, and yet you still have Ash to play with. You go Freezing Curse. Uh, I guess you summon out a Runic. You summon out the Fairy to ditch another Curse to search the Field Spell, activate the Field Spell, and sit on a Curse in hand. So, you're playing with 3 Negates, I guess. Um, so, yeah, I mean, that's interesting. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Uh, that's decent, I guess. I mean, you got the Fountain and the Freezing Curse. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. You've got Starter and Red. That's full combo. That's really good. So, th this deck is, is mad cool. Let's go ahead and move on to the side deck. We're playing three copies of D-Shifter, one Pankratops, one Feather Duster, one Gamma Burst for the OTK, two copies of Smasher, three Evenly Match, one Red Reboot, and three Solemn Judgment, because it's just broken AF. And then for the extra deck, we're playing two copies of the Hugin Runic Wings. This searches for the Field Spell. One copy of Munin, the Runic Wings, this is the one that searches the Continuous Spell. He said he just used this for time. You know, you're about to go to time, and you just activate a, really any Runic quick play spell to summon this out, end your turn, gain a thousand. One Zeus, one Downer Package, two copies of Gigantic Sprite, one Soul Sweeper, one Sky Cow, one Toad, one Dark, and then a Nightmare Package of Cerberus and Phoenix, and then two Sprite Elf. Um, I, as I said at the beginning of this video, Look, I think that this is the best way to play Runic possible. You know, this got top 16 in a YCS, so that in and of itself should speak to how good this way of Sprite is is able to be played. You know, yeah, you can use things like Demise the Land and Metaverse and swap out, like, Runic Fountain for Mystic Mine and things like that. But it's like if you can't get there with Mystic Mine and everybody in a mama is prepared for it, you're going to have a hard time. You know, moving forward for me in this meta, even though I'm kind of taking a break from competitive play after that dog shit regional, um, if I had to pick up a competitive deck to play for an event, I would pick up Runic Sprite. I would play Sprite, throw in a Runic Engine, and just go off to the races. Um, I just, I think it's going to be the best way to play Runic moving forward, especially if you want to troll with, like, milling your opponent out of cards. Like, I feel like the Runic engine is just supplemental like you're not really trying to mill out your opponent it's just that it's helpful in the sense that if you don't open up perfectly with sprite then you can just use the fountain play like two to three runic spells put all three in the bottom of your deck and then draw three new cards like it, it's disgusting you can't tell me that drawing three in 2022 is bad so guys i just want to put out this deck profile very quickly to let you know that hey this is the top 16 Sprite Runic build, and uh, I'm getting ready for everybody and their mama on EDO Pro to be playing this, and uh, we're going to rage quit every time. I'm just being honest. I don't need to be playing against this in 2022. Konami, just give us a ban list. Like, can we just have some, some freshness, please? Like, we need some perfume up in this bitch. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.